Corbin, what are we going to get? Eh, food. Oh, I guess we'll get food too, but what do you want? What else are we going to get? Um, kitten. A kitten? Are we getting a kitten? You want a pet kitten? A, a pet kitten for Kezzy. Kitten for Kezzy. Anyway, yes, we are going to, in search of a pet cat. We were told where we could find one, so we're headed to a vet that supposedly has, um, often has kittens that are looking for a good home. And um, we were told that's the only way to get rid of the rats here, so that's what we're gonna try. <laughs> Two things. Tell and talk about that whole story. First of all, there <laughs> it took forever to find where we were trying to find this cat because and we passed it twice. And we passed it twice because there's just there's every there's no addresses. Yeah, it's anyway. We'll probably do a whole other video on that. Second, there was no so originally there was there was no cat at the vet, but they put us in touch with the person that has a cat. So we finally found this person. I mean, finally found this person, and um, <laughs> they had. The cat. They had their poor cat in this rice sack. <laughs> I would have, honestly, if it would have been a nice cat and not start trying to start fighting me and like doing crazy panic meows, I would have probably taken it just to rescue the poor thing. Just to rescue the cat. But with the kids, it would seem like it was a little bit of an angry kind of cat. Which, I mean, who's to blame? I would be angry if I was kept in a bag too. That's why we need to get a kitten. <laughs> That's why we're wanting to get a kitten because we want to start right at the beginning and hopefully be able to have a, a nice, loving Corbin, kit. sit in your chair. <laughs> That's our goal. Sit in your chair. It's just, uh, yeah, uh, that was an adventure <laughs> for cat. What are we going to do today? Yeah. What are we going to go do? Uh, ride the truck. We're going to ride the truck, right? But what are we going to go get? Food. <laughs> I suppose we may get a little food. Today is a day that I never thought would come. Huh? We are about to get an animal that I never thought we would get. We're gonna get a kitty cat. And this time we're actually are going to get a kitty cat because we have one waiting for us. But anyway, we need to go or we're going to be late to get our kitty cat. Today we become cat people because we refuse to be rat people. This cat is perfect. Like it is okay with me holding it. It is okay with me petting it. It just is sitting in my lap being a very good cat. It's probably just really happy to be out of the box, but it's super gentle and super good natured so far. We'll just have to see. Have you ever bathed the kitten before? No. Nope. So do you know what you're doing? Hi. No. Nope. Oh. She's fine. Kitten. Kitten. Don't pick it up. You just pet it. Oh, it's got so many bites. Oh, is that a nice kitten? We gotta find a name for it. What do you want to name the kitten? No, no, no. Okay. Be nope, gentle. No, okay. no. Don't put that on. It's a nice, hey. it's a nice hey. nature. Hey. That is, can you call it a paw? A footprint. Rat prints. Oh. Show them your elbow. Show her your elbow. Oh. Those are your knees. Oh, honey, I'm sorry. This one's worse. Oh, man. Bad. Oh, my knee. Yeah, mommy will take your shoes off. Somehow the rat got onto the sticky trap and also got off the sticky trap, which is kind of a, like goes against the whole purpose of the sticky trap. But anyway, we caught it already, so we're gonna throw the sticky trap away because we do not want to catch our cat on the sticky trap. You go for That's a lot of cat. Don't you think that's a little too much to do? It's still like it's probably really tiny. Kitten, Tina! What is the kitten doing? Hmm, a food. 
So we're going to wash the cat, we're going to comb the cat, and then we're going to put the um, front liner on the cat's neck. So, here we go. Let's see how well this cat does in water. It's probably kind of used to water. Oh, it's funny, look at that one, the front paw isn't like... It does not like it. Okay, well, I'm sorry. <laughs> I might want some gloves. Okay, the cat didn't like the water, so now we're going to warm up some water. <laughs> we're going to warm up some water to see if it'll do better if the water's warm. She said, good luck. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go get some work gloves that I have in the... That you don't mind getting all wet and everything? Yeah. He's like, look, I, I'm cleaning myself. Like, I don't need this. <laughs> Maybe I need to wash it? Will you Maybe hold you the go ahead and wash it. Look how dirty that water is. She has fleas everywhere. I've never seen so many fleas in all my life. So, I mean, this cat has not tried to bite me once. That is, this cat is such a good-natured cat. Is the cat getting a bath? Bath. So we're just gonna try to get as much fleas off as we can, but mostly the dirt and then put the flea comb and put the flea stuff. She has not bitten once. And I was all around, I mean, she and has like, fleas just crawling like all it. over her face. She's all her, all her scratching and everything has not been like aggressive. It's just been I'm trying to get out of this water. Which I would too, because that water is disgusting. I'm just gonna give a little bit more soap. <laughs> I think she get underneath her too. I'm heating up some more water. This is the second tub of water. Oh, these things are jumping. And um, like once you break, I mean, should we have bathed the cat outside? Are the fleas just gonna be in our house now? Oh, I hate fleas. I were at home health care through college, and there was one house that I went to that had fleas everywhere. Sat on the couch, and fleas were jumping all over. Like, literally, I had fleas all over my ankles and shoe laces and shoes and clothes. I was just... Oh, my word. This poor kitty has fleas everywhere, huh? is loving life right now. Well, she's a little cold and a little scared. So this cat has not left this blanket. We're really hoping that it's not dying. That would kind of stink. Yeah, we're hoping, the, the original owner said that the it was bullied by the other cats. And so we're hoping that it's just kind of like, I can finally rest now. Um, and I'm not being bothered, so I'm just gonna conk out and sleep for 82 hours. Um, but anyway, it is eating, it is eating, so she is eating. We got her clean, she still has fleas. Um, but now we got Frontline on her, so hopefully that can knock out the rest of the fleas and we can get rid of that problem. I don't like fleas. But you don't like rats either. I like, yeah, I like cats. Without fleas. Without fleas, better than rats. I don't know that I like cats with fleas better than rats, but... It's about a even no-no. <laughs> we don't know. We're horrible cat people. <laughs> so please just reserve your criticisms. It's not that we're horrible cat people, we're just not cat people. <laughs> that is a lot of dust. Okay, okay, okay. Shake that out and see how deep that is. Kind of pretty. Hopefully Corbin doesn't think it's food. This is not food. That was of God that I walked in. So there was a can of a, a, a bottle of motor oil and a water bottle that was left in our room. And I walked in just as he was getting ready to put it up to his mouth. I don't know how I, I did not put the motor oil in there. I don't know who did. We've had several people. Colton! It was you. <laughs> that looks like no cow litter I've ever seen before, but. This, it, I mean, this looks like sidewalk salt that we use in the States. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try it. I did read that as soon as you bring the kitten home, you want to have the litter ready because you don't, that it should be, that should be the best way, the easiest way to potty train or litter train. And I really, we need to get 
Corbin started on potty training and I do not want to have to potty train two children. <laughs> or, well, the kitten is not a children. <laughs> no, this cat is not a child. That's not what I meant. I do not want to have to potty train two separate things. Two separate beings. <laughs> two separate, a child and a cat at the same time. So, anyway, I hope that we're not too late on this cat litter thing. What are we supposed to do, just set the cat in there? Mm -hmm. Like, what? Like, why are you disturbing me? Oh. What's that? Yes. It's like, I'm gonna go back to my bed. Yeah. Get them potty. Yeah, you're supposed to go potty in here. Yeah, you have a potty chair too. Kinda like the cat has a potty pan. <laughs> Okay, so I have not met one cat in the Solomon Islands that would let me do this. I just hope it's okay and not sick. I don't know. Is this the beginning of a beautiful friendship? Look, Corbin's more interested in his show. But the cat has kind of been there for the last few minutes and just kind of really enjoyed staying around Corbin. The cat has gotten around and actually explored. <laughs>